Hey, this is Travis from Jakey Music, uh, coming at you with a quick product highlight on uh, a nice pro trumpet we have today. Um, we're looking at the Jupiter XO series. Um, this specific horn I have is the Jupiter 1602S. Uh, it's their silver version of their 1602 line. The, um, they also come in standard lacquer as well as silver with gold uh, caps. Let me go ahead and show you the inside of the case here. It's a nice tweed kind of case with uh, leather coverings on the corners there. Nice uh, kind of a dark red plush velvet style finish on the inside. Um, the horn itself is here. The uh, Jupiter XO series is generally considered to be Jupiter's version of the, uh, well, it's what they call their sophist part of their sophisticated horns version, uh, or line, rather. It's um, comparable to the Yamaha Zeno and Bach Stradivarius lines. Um, it's touted as, of the XO series, one of the most flexible horns that they have. Um, really good for any sort of playing scenario, anything uh, that you can think of that you need to use it for, whether that's nice dark orchestral music or bright, punchy jazz commercial music. Um, we're going to put that to the test a little bit here and, and give it a quick play test. Let me just grab this mouthpiece and let's see how she sounds. So as you can tell, nice, smooth, broad sound, really nice and uh, nice and warm. Um, this, like I said, this horn is great for just about any pro application. Um, it's, like I said, comparable to the Zeno and Bach Pro lines, but it's a little bit more budget friendly. And this is, it makes it the perfect horn for someone who's looking at, uh, you know, either just going into high school or graduating high school and maybe going into college or even someone who's thinking about just starting to play professionally um, it's it's a nice budget-friendly option that looks great sounds great it's really flexible uh, in terms of the you know sound that you're gonna be able to produce with it so you get a lot more in terms of bang for your buck really um, so you know, any anyone would be, I'm sure, happy um, with a horn like this. Um, the the only thing that I would say, people who might not be well suited for this horn, would be students or those who are um, new. Excuse me, those who are new to the uh, new to playing trumpet. Um, you can spend a little bit less money and get a student or intermediate level horn and it'll be something that isn't so far above your skill level that you can't quite take advantage of every um, benefit that the horn has uh, whereas with this if you know once again if you're a pro or you're just about a pro uh, this is a good option now Jupiter I love Jupiter because they always put a bunch of extra goodies and in the uh, in the case that you get with the horn, we have a uh, let's get that to focus there. A nice XO series mouthpiece. They've got some ultra pure valve oil. A cleaning rag with uh, a pair of keys for the case. This is really cool. 
Um, all the, all, as to my knowledge, all the Jupiter Pro horns do this, but it is a, a little padded pouch here. And what they've done is include, for your benefit, uh, as a player, a C-shaped, rounded style lead pipe as opposed to the standard D shape lead pipe. Um, and what that does is it gives you the option to switch these out um, if you're playing something that requires a slightly different sound or you want something that, um, you know, maybe you just have a preference for a specific, um, a specific feeling because the changing in the curvature of the lead pipe is going to change how it sounds and how it feels on your face. Um, the last thing here that they include, and they wrap it up all nice, but I'll take it out to show you, is this little case here. And what this has is a bunch of extra accessories that you can use for the horn. Um, we've got some metal valve caps, um, or I'm sorry, finger buttons, uh, additional valve caps, metal valve guides, and different valve springs. So as you can see here, starting with the finger buttons, they are a pearl inlaid onto the silver. Let's see if I can get that to focus a little closer here. There we go. Whereas these finger buttons are metal, just straight up a polished uh, silver plated brass. We've also got the standard, um, or I'm sorry, the they come standard with these double um, what are considered heavy bottom caps for the valves as opposed to the standard weight. Um, and then we have the uh, all these small pieces I gotta get to focus. Metal valve guides as opposed to the plastic valve guides and like I said the springs which are a slightly different weight so if you're looking at modifying the um, you know making the sound of the horn a little bit darker, adding a little bit more mass to the horn. Um, you can use these heavier valve caps on one, two, or all three of the valves. You can use the, um, change out the valve guides to the same effect and the valve springs if you're looking at changing the spring tension in one, two, or three, all three valves. Um, so it's really something that you can customize and it's, it's uh, very much meant to be a user-friendly and, and more personalizable thing, uh, if that's even a word. Um, and I know I mentioned it briefly here, but just to show you again, this is a beautiful case. Uh, it's got the EXO kind of logo embossed on, or uh, uh, yeah, embossed on a plate on there. It's got the standard kind of two handle setup that you see. And it's just a really, like, it's a really good looking case as well. On top of everything else that you get with the horn. So, um, just to kind of recap, it's, it's a great flexible horn from Jupiter's Pro series, uh, their XO series. It is um, quite a bit. Um, more budget friendly than some of the other pro options out there. It's a lot more bang for your buck, certainly, with how flexible of an option it is. Uh, and it's perfect for someone who is looking at uh, stepping up to a pro horn, whether that's someone, you know, a, a, an advancing student or an actual professional musician. Sometimes those two things are the same person. So um, hopefully you found this helpful and I, been able to answer a lot of your questions about this particular horn. Um, as always, if you have any other questions, feel free to, you know, just contact us, let us know. Um, other than that, once again, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.